Roomba dies before docking? Tips and solutions to solve. Roombas are awesome robot vacuum cleaners that save you a lot of time and effort. As much as these modern electronic devices are easy to use, they could develop complicated faults, just like any other electronic gadget, after some time. Of the several problems the device can have, some common ones include the Roomba dying before it docks, not returning to the base when the battery is not charging, and several others. Roomba dies before docking. The first thing that comes to mind when your Roomba is either dying before docking or isn't returning to home base after the cleaning cycle would be the reason for that occurrence. If you're new to using the Roomba, the device is designed to return to the home base to recharge and dock once it runs out of battery or has completed the cleaning cycle. You can manually send your Roomba to dock itself before the cleaning cycle is over or the battery drained if you want. Reasons why your Roomba isn't docking and what to do. Charger line damage. Inspect the cable that connects the dock to the wall outlet. Since the docking station is on the floor, a kick or shunt could have resulted in the cable becoming pinched, frayed, or severed. In this case, trying to repair the wires is quite dangerous. And it's better to get a new charger. Damage docking station. Unplug, and pick up the dock and check the docking station and if it looks damaged or the plastic is broken. If this is the case, you might be facing a more significant problem and may need to replace the docking station. Broken docks adapter. While the charging cable is plugged in, wiggle the end area where the cable goes into the dock to see if it seems loose. It's possible that even while the cable is correctly connected to an adapter, the fault might also be with the adapter. You would likely need to buy a new docking station for occurrences like this. The docking station incorrectly plugged. If you have inspected your cable and are satisfied with its conditions, check the docking station and ensure that it's plugged in the right way. In a busy home where there are lots of movements, anything could go wrong with the connection. Push the charging cable in securely and make sure the power indicator indicates illuminates solid green. Electrical outlet's fault. If you suspect the fault is from the electrical outlet, move the docking station from its regular position to another outlet. Connect the charging cable securely, and confirm if it indicates a green light. If it does, then your Roomba has started working correctly, you may only need to fix the previous outlet. Dirty charging contacts. Your next bet is to check the Roomba's charging contacts and the dock BQ's metal contacts on both the Roomba and the dock need communication for the Roomba to locate its home base and charge. Sometimes dust on the charging ports makes the unit think it's already on charge when it isn't and you need to wipe the contacts with a dry, soft cloth and take the Roomba to the dock to see if it works. Likewise, if the home base's bumper has tape, paint or a sticker stuck on it, the Roomba won't dock. Furniture and obstructions in the room. Check for clutters or furniture that could hinder the Roomba's path and restrict it from docking. If the Roomba is experiencing obstructions, clear the way and surrounding to about 2.4 meters around the home base. Bad battery. Sometimes the battery may need more than just a recharge, and you have to buy a new battery to get the Roomba back in shape. Why is your Roomba not finding a home base? Aside from debris on the charging contacts, the distance may also cause the Roomba to have difficulty finding the home base, especially when cleaning multiple rooms. First, you should ensure the unit can locate the Roomba before it begins its mission and place the unit about 2 meters from the base, press dock, and see if it works. If your device is compatible with virtual wall lighthouses or virtual walls, you may need to remedy this situation by using either of them to guide the Roomba home or set it to clean smaller spaces. Another important thing to note is that Roomba only finds the home base after a cleaning cycle if it either starts at the home base or can see the home base at some point during the cleaning session. How to send your Roomba to dock? The easiest way to manually dock your Roomba is either by picking it up and taking it to the home base by yourself or by pressing the home or dock button on the Roomba unit, which returns to base.